The Transportation Security Administration says one of their biggest issues at the airports is people bringing guns and other unsecured weapons through the TSA. 12 News, Marie Minifield has a warning from TSA officials informing people about the potential consequences of bringing an unchecked weapon on a flight. Some flyers are bringing knives, tasers, brass knuckles, large rocks, and other potential weapons through airport doors. And they are all collected by the thousands each year as flyers are screened by TSA. There's been a tremendous amount of uptick in uh, incidents, uh, so fights, whatever, and planes have to divert to different air, uh, airports before they get to their destination. Uh, these, kind of, these type of uh, weapons here is considered a weapon if it's used in the wrong manner. Uh, is prohibited from being on, on an aircraft, onto an aircraft. If a person would like to carry a concealed gun, it must be in a hard case. Have TSA approved locks and most importantly, be properly checked. Locks, and they must be TSA approved. Uh, any other ammunition must be carried in a box designed specifically for carrying ammunition. And should a person fail to declare this weapon and receive this card from the airline, and into that checkpoint, they are arrested. According to officials, if a gun or weapon is not properly checked, a person can face fines upwards of $15,000, lose TSA pre-check, and miss flights and even be arrested. We stop the guns, we intercept them, and then we pass them and that situation to our police partners. It's the police that take control of that gun and then, as the sergeant said, they will arrest you. You will also face the penalties from the TSA. But we just wanted to point out that the TSA is not confiscating the guns. We're not confiscating these items, in fact, because we give you a chance to go back to the airline counter and check your bag. Visit TSA.gov if you need more information on weapon restrictions at the airport. Reporting in Jackson, Marie Minneville, 12 News.